Hey guys, what's up? My name is Art. Welcome to the Warren Show for 2022. Yes, this is the first comic book day haul of the year. Now, it's cold outside and I shovel snow this morning. Well, I actually got home last night around about like almost one o'clock because it was snowing so bad and the trap and the it, you had to drive like maybe like 30 to 40 miles an hour on the freeway so it was kind of nerve-wracking at times so you know I got home couldn't sleep woke up shovel snow picked up my comics went shopping now I'm home Sam Adams Winter Lager Kind of need this after today. But that's not why you're here. I hope not. That's not why you're watching. I hope not. What happened was I picked up some books this week. Half of my store, only one of my stores was open on New Year's Day, which is Saturday, the day I pick up my books. So then I said, okay, well, I have to go today. Because my local my local LCS does not have does not carry DC, so I had to go to other stores to pick up DC books. So I went there to one store today, and guess and what happened was half the people called off. So there's like one or two people at the register. So I was like, okay, let me try to get in and get out as fast as possible. got Robin number nine right now I'm really loving this story imagine kind of like a moral combat feel to it pick the timeless number one bounty hunters number 19 doom the whisper of the cast Kaladin seas a Whisper of the Kaladin Seas, number one. Uh, the one thing about the Dune series is like they have a little series, and then boom. Then another series pops up, instead of just having one continuous thing. Oh well. Amazing Spider-Man, number 83. I haven't read 82 yet. Dove's Ring, 2 of 6. I haven't read number one yet. Also, at my local shop... Found the bundle that I was looking for. I finally picked it up. I'm an avid hero click player, so to speak. And uh, the newest set was called Avengers Fantastic Four Empire. So naturally, when I saw this, I had to buy it. Now I can read it. That's number one. Number two. Number three. Number four number five and the last one number six if any of you read this if any of you read the story let, let me know before i read because it's probably gonna take me like another week or so before i read this let me know what you think about it also i picked up sylvie from the what the what if line which builds the watcher this is one of there's a couple figures that's hard to find, starting to become hard to find, and this is one of them, in my opinion. Well, in my area, it is. I don't know in your area, but in my area, it is. And you know, because there wasn't that much out this week, I thought, oh my gosh, what kind of, what kind of, what kind of video I could do? Then the mail showed up. One of the stores I go, one of the online stores I go to is called Comics Elite, and they had a mystery bundle sale, a mystery, it was a mystery slab bundle sale. So what happened? There was two categories: a seventy dollar one and like a ninety dollar one. I said, mm, was it seventy? Yeah, I, yeah, there was a $70 one and there was a $90 one. 
I was looking around because it comes with a slab and some books. And I thought to myself, the 90 would give me a lot more stuff. But then again, un another shop I go to, Unknown Comics, had another bundle sale kind of like that too. And I was like, $90 here and the Unknown Comics is still on its way. But anyway, so the Comics Leap version showed up and I can't wait and I'll let's show it to you. I don't even, I just opened the package up haven't seen what any of these books is so we'll go with the raw books first Captain America Empire number three okay Empire tie-in all right Batman Catwoman oh this is book one I heard this is a very interesting series Comics Elite is one of those kind of places that deals in variant books a lot. A lot of the books is variants. Batman something. 108. Okay. So far, not bad. This is not bad a collection of books. Fight Girls? Upshot. Ooh, 105. I've heard of this. Don't know what anything is about, but... Fight Girls. If you know anything about Fight Girls, let me know down below. See, maybe I should be, I don't know, it's from AWA Upshot. And the only one I'm reading from them is Knighted, which is really cool. So let me know if this is a good book, if you if you read it. Then yeah, I might have to track it down. This one feels a little thick, so we'll save that one for later. Usagi Yojimbo number 7, I believe. Which is good. I have this one already because I click Usagi Yojimbo. Empire number 6. Variant edition. Well, since I already have Empire the whole series, this is a nice variant book right here. Okay. Really cool. Alright. Maestro number 1. Variant edition. Very good. I love the Maestro series, mini series. I loved it a lot. Then when it kept going on with it, I'm like, mm, okay. This one was a little bit thick, so let's see what this is. What the fuck is that? Shiny? Dragon Con? Whoa! Okay, okay. I'm gonna sorry, I gotta pop this bad boy open and see what this is. Wow. Oh, it's uh White Widow, I think. There's this uh, character called White Widow I've been hearing about. Did don't know what it's about, but you know, from the looks of it, it sounds pretty kind of coolish in a way. So I guess this is the Dragon Con um, special edition or, or edition for Dragon Con, I believe, maybe. If you know anything about that, let me know. Because I'm kind of interested in that now. I, based upon that, that's kind of interesting. That is, this is damn neat. All right. That was pretty cool. And now the slab. The reason why I picked this one because it's a mystery slab. And I did say I was going to try to buy more slabs. Either I was going to get some stuff. Either I'm going to get some stuff graded. Either I'm going to get some more books graded. Which I haven't done yet. Or get some books slab slab. So let's see what we got here. Batman 108 at a 
this a this the miracle Molly for thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, shut the front door. Cohen variant cover C. Comics Kingdom of Canada exclusive variant. First full appearance of Miracle Molly Virgin cover. I heard of Comics Kingdom. Or Comics Kingdom or Comic Kingdom Com Comics Kingdom? Uh, yes, yeah, Comics Kingdom. I heard of them. And I believe the comic vet mentioned them a couple times. I think he did. Because he lives in Canada. This is nice. Here's a back. Wow. First full appearance of Mo Miracle Molly. Very. That. That's pretty cool. This is pretty damn cool. Wow, this is worth. I mean, tell you the truth, that and that, this and the slab was technically worth it for me. Out of that seventy dollars, you know, that was technically worth it. Because you know, a slab is usually around fifty to seventy bucks anyway. So, so basically, what happens? You pay for the slab and you get books for free. So with that being said, that is it for the haul of the week. The first haul of the week. And um, hope you liked it. Um, if you heard if you heard of any if you read any of those books, if you read Empire, let me know what you think down below. I do want to read it and I'm going to read it. I just want to know your thoughts of it so that way I can even though I don't mind it what people tell me their their viewpoints on it I still going to read it for myself you can tell me a movie sucks but until I watch it and say it sucks it don't suck it has the potential to suck in a book if a book sucks until I read it the book don't suck so with that being said thank you very much for watching if you like the comment give me a thumbs up give me a thumbs down I think you can still do that maybe not not too sure like comment subscribe share me with your friends family fools and the and the sandman the sandman the snowman down the street build a snowman put the phone in your put the phone in his hand make a, make sure he has a little hand put the phone in the hand play that video and watch that frown watch him melt because this because sometimes these videos are hot garbage but anyway just joking <laughs> I'm going to tell you something, 2022 seems to be a very, it's promising to be an awesome year. And I hope it is an awesome year for you guys. Hope you get, hope you buy the stuff that you want, the stuff that you need. Hopefully you get a girlfriend slash boyfriend or get married and maybe get that happy divorce. Maybe. Get the stuff you want. I mean, my goals are set high this year. I want to plan some, I have some stuff planned and I want to meet some, meet some of these goals. I want to do a lot of stuff. Yes, I know. I need to shave. Yes. Hair, head needs to be shaved. Face needs to be shaved too. Kind of lazy these days. Here's to your health and happiness. And I'll see you in the next one.